happen like that? Hit this area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like butterfly gonna be captain. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. Damien Myers needs to be on loan. I got my big hat on, cause I really need to talk to you niggas. I got my big hat on, cause this is how, this is how Danny be trying to talk to niggas. Okay. Bar God, I really feel like Danny needs to be on loan. Uh, no, no questions asked. Um, but my thing is, Vada, is that uh, Danny needs to be on loan, and I don't want him battling. No disrespect, I don't want him battling anybody from the new era. Truth be told, I really don't want him battling anybody from the new era. I really think that Danny needs a higher level of competition. No disrespect to the new era. They are the spooky guys. They are the ones that are scaring niggas. And those are the only ones that inked up in smoke. So I'm not too opposed to the new era unless we talk about somebody like, like a real sick. Um, Luke Castro doesn't count, but I would want to see Luke Castro and Danny. Um, I would definitely want to see like a Fonz versus Danny if we go in that route, but you know what? Fuck it. I want to see real sick versus Danny on no. I need to see real sick versus Danny. I need to see that. I need to see that. Reason why I need to see that is because there is levels. And Danny already showed Kid Chaos there was levels to how he writes. JC already showed none none. There is levels to how they write. It is crazy how they put those people who have the strong pins or they have that strong energy to go up against somebody. And yet and still, they got to give. It's just like it's just not enough. Same thing when it comes to somebody battling Rum Nitty. Like you expect them to have godly bars. Godly, godly, godly bars against Rum Nitty. And when they just come with something regular, it's, it's like, ah, ah. Well, it, it, it wasn't that crazy. It wasn't that crazy. I'm just I'm, I'm just throwing it out there. But. For Danny Myers to not be on Gnome's Highway Robbery, we already talked about this. We already talked about how Danny is already underappreciated every single time, every single battle. Can you name a battle that Danny Myers choked in? Can you name the Danny Myers battle that he choked in? All right, put it all in the comments if y'all still remember. Because let me tell you something. It was early. It was in the quarantine era. It was early. It was early in the game. Just saying, I'm just saying. But y'all count that one versus I don't know how many battles this nigga has had over the course of three months. I don't know how many battles this nigga has had over the course of this whole quarantine time. This nigga Danny battles any and everybody, okay? He doesn't care who he battles. That's the problem, though. We talk about known. We talk about night of main events. That means if it's the night of main events, it needs to be a main event battle. So... For for me personally, yeah, one of one of these big niggas is going to have to come outside. One of one one, one, one rock, you going to have to come outside. For Danny, yeah, yeah, you got to come outside. It's gonna have to happen. It's gonna have to happen. I gotta have the heavy bars. Speaking of gnome, is it possible that Gigi Gotti could battle two times on gnome? Is that is that a thing? Can he do that? Can we can we do that? Is that let me let me ask the judges. Can we do that? Is that a thing? No? I I mean, technically you can do it. I mean, on the exception that Ill Will did it first. Ill Will battled two niggas in one night. Well, he battled, uh, he battled, uh, who did he battle in, in the same thing? He battled, uh, uh, Miami, right? Miami, Miss Miami. And he battled, uh, uh, intercom section, put it down there. Because I'm just slipping my mind. Or oh, body, you can go ahead and check that for me. But I'm pretty sure that, uh, Ill Will... Smoked two niggas that night, and it was a 60. So it's very possible for Geechee Gotti to battle two times on Gnome. But the thing is, Geechee Gotti would be doing a final battle, like the championship battle on Gnome, and he would have whatever opponent he had on Gnome. This is crazy, man. This is crazy. Geechee, you doing a lot right now. I'm not saying you're doing too much. I'm just saying you're doing a lot right now. 
for the way that you write, it works because you can go in there. Like what you said to the uh to uh to um uh what you said on Lex on I Battle, what you said not to Lex, but what you said on I Battle, <laughs> I ain't even right for this bitch. The fact that I knew that you was freestyling that, it still was good. Like I I just have an issue with Gigi Gotti with the freestyling and the bus like it's so blended in you don't know who's it's for. So it is possible for Gigi to battle two times on no. I don't want that. I don't want I don't recommend it for anybody. I mean who the hell wanna work a double ship? You look at the money and the payout at the end, that's always good. But you look at that hours and that time spent, it is brutal. You know damn well if you work in a double by hour nine. We having problems. You muscling it through 10, 11, 12. You <coughs> you finna die. You you just gonna die. All I'm saying is, Geechee, you can battle on Gnome, but I don't think you should battle two times on Gnome. What you should do is let Swamp just go ahead and get this win in and, and let him get on down and get his look. Because otherwise... You already know what we want to see for Gnome when it comes to Swamp. So if Swamp ain't in the competition, we know he going to be on Gnome. Simple as that. And I'm gone. I'm on some real murder, sh eh? Anybody that ever looked at me wrong owes me money or said any jealous is dead, B. You already know who it is. You already know what we do. It's time to talk about what we need to talk about. Danny Myers needs to be on gnome i'm not asking i'm not saying that oh well let's let's politic ain't no politics danny myers deserves to be on gnome i really don't care like so much about against who but as a testament to the work that he's been putting in i definitely agree with my brother showtime sp the work that he's been putting in is unparalleled he battled every single new nigga y'all asked him to Every one of them. You gave him every single new nigga. New niggas that ain't even new niggas no more. I gave him every single one. He's done his thing. He just battled Kid Chaos. He beat him. He battled uh, Easy the Black Captain. He didn't battle every single person in y'all new class. The, the best way to pay him back is to put him on Gnome. On the card. Not no sneaking him in there. Uh, surprise battle. Yo, I got one more. I got one more for y'all. Know what I'm saying? Nah, 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 none of that shit. He deserves the same promotion, the same love, the same admiration, the same everything that everybody else gets because it's important to your career and important to your catalog. Shit, Mr. Wavy been on something. Nigga, Mr. Wavy has been on Summer Madness, my nigga. I know it was a long time ago, but Mr. Wavy's been on Summer Madness. You mean to tell me that Danny Myers don't deserve a gnome, a real plate, like to be recognized as one of them ones? Because when you when you make to them big cards, you one of them ones. You getting respected. You getting solidified. They putting respect on your name. You getting promotion. Danny Myers deserves that. He's been battling for 150 fucking years, and y'all y'all still playing with this man's name. He battled Arsenal. Three owed him. You know what I'm saying? He ain't lost a round this year. This nigga ain't lost. This nigga ain't lost a round in 2021 and battles every day. What? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to battle Danny Myers. You know what I'm saying? I actually like I'm gonna have to get him. Is it gonna I'm gonna have to take him out of here because ain't nobody beating him. You know what I'm saying? He needs a plate that's respectable, that's commendable, and that shows appreciation to the shit that he's been doing. Like and that's that's neither that's then he you know he deserves everything he deserves you know how people saying he's the front runner for champion of the year he deserves all that shit Danny Myers is, is the one right now that nigga's wild as son he deserves all of the accolades that he could be potentially getting because he has put in the work Showtime SP said oh Danny Myers ain't choked he has he has he's the reason for the intro. Y'all wanna know what happened? I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked when he decided to take like three battles in three days. I think it was Passwords, some nigga in Miami, and some other nigga. He battled all three of them. He started choking all over the place. Then he choked versus Jerry West. But it's not who he is, though. A singular action does not determine who a person is if it's not, repet not repetitive. He don't do that shit in every battle. He shows up. 
He don't recycle. Like, Danny Myers deserves the admiration. And all the props and love that he's getting. He shows up ready. He shows up with three rounds. He's going to bring you a good cadence. He's going to wow on his opponents. And he, the one thing that I respect about him the most is he gives the same energy to small league guys that he does to big name, big stage guys. Go check out Danny Myers versus Mac Myron if you think I'm joking. You know, the Mac Myrons of the world deserve more love too. There's a lot of people that probably should have been in that tournament that didn't get that look while you got other niggas in there just not even writing. <laughs> just, just, I'm coming up here freestyle for 100, 100 racks. But uh, the other question was, will Geechee Gotti battle twice on the same night? Showtime SP thinks, he's crazy though. He's, that's my brother, but he's crazy. He thinks Geechee Gotti should just give a battle to Swamp so he could focus on Gnome. Nigga, is you crazy? I wouldn't give a fuck if Geechee Gotti go up there and read the alphabet backwards on Gnome. For 100,000, he better focus on that motherfucking tournament. Forget battling twice in the same day. If you do, you better do that shit that, uh, that Twerk did. Sue Surf told me at the face-off last night, nigga, you better start rapping about some bullshit. Because ain't no way in hell you gonna let unless unless they're gonna pay you a hundred thousand dollars to battle on gnome versus like a calico or some shit like that. And that ain't happening. So put your focus where your focus should be. Your mind on your money and your money on your mother mind, dog. I think that he could battle twice in the same day. Ill Will did it, but Ill Will's a phenomenal freestyler. And and Ill Will had your honor and Miss Miami the same day. Um he beat both of them 6-0. But uh, Geechee Guy, you need to focus on that tournament. Because I feel like this tournament is in a basket. Hand bred to him now. Hand fed to him. T-Top and Twerk and all the people that was like really, really dangerous to him. You know, there's a couple, a couple names still around that's pretty decent. But nobody that's dangerous that could really like, yo, I got this person beating Geechee Gotti. Like, Rum Nitty's still around. But Rum Nitty got to tighten up. Because if it's just going to be punch, punch, punch when, when Geechee starts disrespecting you, you know, it could be a different story. So, overall, I think he could battle twice in the same night. But, uh, focus on the tournament. Get it?